We'd like to introduce you to the scientific diving methodology program in our first video, but this is only meant to get your feet wet. More details can be found in subsequent videos. This project is open to a large swath of the population, most of whom could be classified as citizen scientists. That is any person who, without being a researcher or professional, still wants to contribute important data for future investigations gleaned from their dives. A second group who can benefit from scientific diving methodology are experienced divers who can learn aspects of the scientific side. Collecting data and specimens correctly and logging information precisely so that the samples can be of scientific value. This course is also aimed at members of the scientific community who need to learn to dive and acquire the skills to handle various tools for sampling and measuring in aquatic environments, thus carrying out their scientific tasks in the water as easily as they do on terra firma. The objective of the course is to introduce divers to scientific diving techniques carried out according to safety protocols. The course furnishes the know-how to do science more critically and efficiently while guaranteeing the quality of the data and observations obtained. This course features a diving training regimen that will get participants into tip-top shape as they learn specialized diving techniques and general aspects of safety and emergency procedures. They learn how to master the planning, organization, and execution of underwater work as well as specific observation techniques, data collection, sampling, and mapping. In this way, the then certified scientific diver can concentrate more on his or her research, obtaining better quality data and information upon each dive, carrying out the technical details of diving calmly, automatically, and efficiently. The Posidonia Oceanica meadows are especially vulnerable to the impact of human activity. This, along with their wide geographical distribution in the Mediterranean, have made them excellent candidates as a biomarker for the state of preservation of coastal marine ecosystems. That is why the practical sessions of this first course revolve around this resource, which allows us to train with different scientific diving methodologies, including the evaluation of the state of preservation of seagrass beds and the diversity censuses of key species as well as the monitoring of invasive alien species and the evaluation of physical and chemical parameters in the water column and adjacent sediments. Finally, this course can be used to present information and thereby foster environmental awareness in community groups, schools and universities, thus promoting conservation activities such as monitoring in disturbed areas and longitudinal tracking of the state of marine reserves. And at the same time, teach how to present these data to the scientific community, thus educating divers about the difficult situation in many areas of the seas around us and motivating them to take measures before impacts on the marine environment. We can protect the future of the wonderful landscapes that we see in each dive, providing information to generate scientific publications obtained with environmentally friendly techniques.